The inductees were made up of 103 candidates who participated in the professional engineering examination and 11 candidates who participated in the confirmation hearing route and passed. The 103 inductees who passed their various examinations were from each of the four technical divisions, 47 civil technical division, 21 mechanical and great technical division, 9 chemical mining technical division, and 26 electrical electronic technical division. Addressing the inductees, President of the Ghana Institution of Engineering, Engineer Governor Bimpong called on the newly inducted members to ensure they adhere strictly to the ethics and requirements of the institution in their various fields of practice. It is therefore no small responsibility that you take on today. We at the Ghana Institution of Engineering have always prided ourselves on fostering a spirit of excellence among our members. And I trust that you, our new inductees, will continue with this tradition. Engineering and national development in Ghana, like many other nations, is faced with the challenges of modernization, industrialization, and the need for resilient infrastructure. Your role as engineering practitioners is crucial in finding innovative solutions to these challenges, whether it is in the energy, construction, transportation, environmental protection, or digital technology, you will be at the helm of creating new pathways for or to grow. Your voice is needed to influence policy and drive strategic in initiatives that will shape the future of our nation. The induction ceremony marks the recognition of achievements and expertise of engineers who have undergone rigorous training and examination processes to earn their professional status. The inductees were presented with certificates symbolizing their official recognition as professionals in the field after swearing the engineering oath.